Okay. Okay. Welcome to Wonderland. We've got it all. Potions and pastries that make you grow tall. Forests and cottages, castles and carts that can talk. I had a history test second block, and I think I failed it, to be honest. Mom packed me a chicken salad sandwich, and everyone at the table wanted a bite. Magical cabins and lovely white rabbits with. If you don't know what a chicken salad sandwich is, it's basically a salad with chicken. Yep. Laughing till the morning comes. All right, class, go ahead and partner up. Of course, both Anna and Beth wanted to partner up with me, but to not upset either one of them, I had them partner up instead. But there was also this new girl in class named Delilah. She just transferred here last week. I wanted to partner up with her to show her how nice I was. Miss James? Yes, Miss Anthony? Uh, is everything okay with you, Anna and Beth? I noticed you were working alone today. Yeah, I chose to partner up with the new girl Delilah for the project. Oh, okay. Um, well, have a great day. Thank you, you too. My parents, of course, weren't home when I walked in. I'm home! I think mom's on a business trip in France, and my dad won't come home from the office until at least 11. I know they come home because I hear the door open and shut, and the same to their bedroom door downstairs. Sometimes they leave a note in the morning with their weekly schedule, but I usually just have to figure it out on my own. The house can get very lonely, especially when my dad spends the night at the office. Woohoo, pretty great. Okay. And that was my day today. Hey, you guys see Delilah? She's not here today. Who? I don't know a Delilah. Yeah, I don't think I know a Delilah either. That's weird. She usually sits right over there. I didn't think anyone sat there. I must have forgot. Oh, okay. Thanks for the help, I guess. It was weird without Delilah being there. Class felt more quiet than usual. Anna and Beth were oddly quiet as well. They usually talk all class, but today they didn't say much. I guess Delilah not being there just threw everyone off. Today, Anna, Beth, and I are going to have a sleepover at my house. I haven't really been able to hang out with them much since Delilah transferred. I asked Delilah if she would like to come, but she said she was busy with her mom. I guess I can just catch her next time. Beth was supposed to send me the second half of the project for math two days ago. Well, the project is due tonight and she still hasn't sent me anything. I invited Delilah over the next day. I just wanted to watch a movie or something with someone who actually cared. Calm down, Bree. It's worth 10 points of our grade. Who cares about my grade anyways? At least I have you. You're my one real friend. Hey, uh, I don't really know what to say. Things haven't been going well. Beth won't talk to me, and Anna feels distant as well. They make me feel like I'm crazy. I'm not crazy, am I? Delilah, she doesn't make me feel like I'm crazy. She doesn't make me feel like I'm 11 years old sitting in a doctor's office without an answer for why I'm not normal. I feel normal. I am normal. Anyways, I'm failing math. The project was supposed to bring up my grade and I don't know what to do about it. My mom hasn't said anything about it. And honestly, 
I don't think she ever will. I can't do this right now. I need some space. See, I told you something was wrong. I don't know why, but this makes no sense, yet makes complete sense at the same time. Right. Why didn't she tell us, though? Beth, she had schizophrenia. I don't think she realized something was wrong. Good point. Now that I think about it, there was always something off about her. 